Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello, guys. Thank you so much for joining to today's class. And thank you for being here on time as well. Thank you. Uh, I need you to please turn on your cameras, right? I see some cameras off, right? It is mandatory, according to Insafor, to have your cameras on. And they sent us another message today. So, please help me out with that. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Now, today we're going to continue with our class from yesterday, right? Before we continue, I would like to know if you have any questions about a uh, be going to. No? No questions. Good evening. Good evening. How are you today? Fine, very good. Excellent, glad to hear that. All right. Okay, well, if there are no questions, I would like to start right now, right? We're going to make a small practice with be going to, right? And I'm going to show right now some the conversation topics that we are going to practice, okay? So let me go ahead and show you my computer. So let's get ready. Let's get ready. And let me show you here. Can you see a, what it says, let's talk? Can you see that? Yeah? Yes, yes. Okay, so we have some conversation topics here. I am going to click on Kirala, right? I'm going to click on that. And then I'm going to ask one person, one of you, to answer the question. Okay, so let's talk. Let's start, right? We see the topics there. And the first question is, okay, let's see. Look at the first question right there. Jose Alexander. Hello, Jose. This happens when you come on time. Okay. <laughs> Hello. Now, read the question and give us your answer. Okay. Are robots going to replace people? And no. No. They aren't. they aren't. Okay, why not? Because they cannot think like this. Okay, they cannot think like humans. Okay, very good. Thank you so much, Jose. Well, that's Jose's opinion. I think they are going to replace people. I think so. Well, <laughs> let's continue. We're going to eliminate that one, right? And we're gonna continue there, right? Let's see the next question, right? Look at the questions there. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Do, 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 do. Okay, what do you think the weather is going to be tomorrow? Hmm. What do you think the weather is going to be tomorrow, Eugenia? Hello, teacher. Hello. Do you think the weather is going to tomorrow? We eat there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And what does it mean? Weather. The weather, for example, uh, when we have a rain, it's raining. When there is sun, for example, in Holy Week, in April, we go to the beach because it's sunny, right? Sometimes it's windy, right? And sometimes it's cold. Well, in my city, it's never cold, but yeah, those that's the weather, right? The different changes in every day. Sometimes it's hot, sometimes it's cold. So what do you think the weather is going to be like? Uh-huh, okay. 
Um, a rain. Okay, you're going to please to give us your answers. Uh, I think, uh huh. I think the water, the, the, the rain is going to be tomorrow. Okay, I think, right? It's I going to be. Rain. It's going to be rain tomorrow. Rainy tomorrow. Very good. Excellent. I think it's going to be rainy tomorrow. Very good, Eugenia. Thank you so much. Now we're going to continue there, right? Now, Eugenia, you choose another person, please. But first, first, let's see the question. It says, what are you co what are you going to cook next time? That's easy. Keep it easy. Choose another student, Eugenia. What are you going to cook next time? Joanna, Joanna Lisbeth. Okay, very good. I am going to cook a chicken and potatoes. Chicken and potatoes, very and potatoes. good. Joanna, what kind of potatoes are you going to cook? Oh, uh, horneadas, teacher. Uh -huh. <laughs> what is horneado? Uh, bake. bake, bake potatoes. Bake, bake, potatoes. Yes. bake, bake potatoes. Bake potatoes, <laughs> exactly. Thank you, Joanna. Thank you so much. Now let's continue there with, right, next question. Right, we're going to eliminate this. I'm going to click on, right? We have other question there. Easy. Okay. Are you going to learn to do anything new? Joanna, choose another student. Um, Bernardo. Bernardo. Uh, are you going to learn to do anything new? Mm, yes. Yes, I do. Yes, yes, I am. Yes, I am. Very good. Yes, I am. And what are you going to learn? I'm going to learn to drive truck. To drive a truck? Drive a truck. Oh, my goodness. I don't know how to drive a car. Can you mind that? <laughs> that sounds dangerous. Okay, thank you, Bernardo. Thank you so much. Now, let's question. Next question. I'm sorry. Okay, next question. <laughs> we continue. Let's take a look at the question. It says, dun, dun, dun. Are you going to watch something interesting today? Bernardo, choose another person. Carol. Carol. Carol, are you going to watch something interesting today? I, I call, are you going? Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm. Yes, I'm going to watch something interesting. Something new, okay. And what are you going to watch? The show, the disfraces, no sé cómo se dice. Customs? H customs. Customs, okay. Awesome. You're going to watch customs. Where are you going to watch customs? In my work, the party, the to students. Okay. Now, remember when you're going to watch something new, you usually watch on TV, right? Like on cable or now we have an, a lot of streamers, right? Like Netflix, HBO, Disney Plus, oof, a lot. So what are you going to watch? Watch. What are you watch. going to watch? 
I'm not not going. I'm going. I'm. Um. Mm -hmm. uh, not going to watch the intercity. Okay, you're not going to watch anything. Okay, thank you, Carol. Thank you so much. Now look at the next question, right? Everyone, one more, one more. Okay, Carla. Okay, Carla, are you going to do exercise today? What is Carla? Carla, Carla, Carla. No, she already participated. Another person. Tatiana. 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 Hello, Hello Tatiana. Hello. Mm -hmm. Going to exercise today. Yes, I'm going to exercise today. Okay. I okay. go to the gym. Okay, very good. I'm going to go to the gym. To the gym. I go I going to go to the gym. Okay, very good. Thank you so much, Tatiana. Right. We have three more questions. Right? Next one. What are you going to do tonight? Oof. Tatiana, choose another student. Choose another student, Tatiana. Elena? Elena Guadalupe. Is Elena here? Yes. Yes. Elena, what are you going to do tonight after the class? Um, I am asleep. <laughs> okay, use the use going to. I am going to. Going to I going to sleep. <laughs> Okay, I am going to sleep. Okay, very good. Thank you, Elena. Remember, we're using going to, right? And we only have two questions left, right? First question. Ooh, nice, nice, nice. Are you going to travel this year? Elena, choose another student. It could be anybody. Um, Eduardo Franco. Eduardo Franco. Let me see. Eduardo, are you here? Yes, he's here. Are you going to travel this year? Yes, I do. Are you going to travel this year? Yes, uh, I'm, going, I'm going to travel this year. Okay, what are you going to travel to? I'm going to New York. Oh, nice. New York, Manhattan. Very good. Thank you so much. And now, right, we're just going to go with the last question that says, what are you going to do tomorrow? Now, choose another person. Franco? Choose another party. Another student, yes. Another student, okay. Uh, uh, Jose Alexander. Jose Alexander, okay. Jose, what are you going to do tomorrow? Um, tomorrow, I'm going to have a meeting with my co-worker. Okay, about what? No, yes. Too snoopy, right? <laughs> no, don't tell me about what. Okay, very good, Jose. Thank you so much. Now, Remember the purpose. What did I do? What did I do? Okay, yes. Okay, the purpose of this activity, right, is to practice. Try to understand the vocabulary. One thing that you have to do is that when you listen to a new word, new vocabulary, write it down. Okay, write it on your notebook, write it on your piece of paper, because you are not going to remember those words. Okay. So make sure you do that. Now I'm gonna call the attendance before we forget. I'm gonna pass assistance. Okay.
Give me a moment. Today my internet is very slow. Or I think it's my computer. I don't know. Carlos Vladimir Rodriguez Diaz. Present. Daisy Elizabeth Resinos Alvarez. Good evening, teacher. Present on my way. Okay. Eduardo Franco Núñez. Present. Elena Guadalupe Andrade Reyes. Present. Emerson Ulises Monroy Calix. Present, Miss. Francisco Sánchez López. Francisco Sánchez. Okay. Imelda Xiomara Pineda Castro. Imelda. Jacqueline Vanessa Parrilla García. Joana Lisbeth Eunice Alfaro de Canales. Present, Miss. Thank you. Jose Alexander Hernández Carvajal. Present, teacher. Okay. Jose Bernardo López Montes. Present teacher. Carla Eugenia Hernández Sotelo. Present teacher. Carol Elizabeth Escalante Enriquez. Carol Elizabeth. Present. Luis Javier Castillo. Present. Manuel Alfredo Hernández Ventura. Oscar Noé Magaña Martínez. Present teacher. Sara Abigail López Portillo. Present teacher. Thank you, give me more. Tatiana Ivonne Torres de Beltrán. I am here, Miss. Wendy Marlene Martinez Sánchez. Present. Janira del Carmen Gutiérrez. Present. Pablo Adalberto Abrego Vázquez. Present. Hi there. Okay, very good. So we have the attendance for today. Yes. Let's see. Me escuchó, Miss. This is yes. I did, I did. Just give me a moment right here. We're gonna do an activity right now or we're gonna complete an activity that it's related to, mucha lluvia en Zaragoza el internet inestable. Que se quede la lluvia por allá ahorita. Que venga después que termine la clase. No. Si no se me pone inestable a mí también. Ok. Now, yesterday we work with the use of going to. Right? We practice a lot with conversations. Now, today we are going to practice on page 13. Page 13 on your book. Right? On page 13, we're going to talk about products, right? And the different features that a product may have, right? As we can see here on our, on our book, we have different features here. We have features and product. The product is tablet, television, refrigerators, right? Tablet, television, refrigerators. Vladimir, can you repeat? Tablets, Television, refrigerators. Tablet, television, refrigerators. Very good. Now we have features. In the features that we have, right? We have wave, dimension, quantity. Wave, dimension, quantity. Janira, can you please repeat? Wave, dimension, quantity. Way, dimension, quantity. Excellent. Very good. Now, what is the weight of the tablet? What is the weight of the tablet? Mm -hmm. 117 grams. 170 grams. Excellent, Vladimir. Right, that will be the weight of the tablet. Now, the same for the uh, television, and here we have refrigerators. The only difference is that for the tablets, we have grams, right? For the television, we have pounds, right? 
So imagine 112 pounds, that's a lot, right? That's a lot for a TV. Maybe it's an old TV, right, from 1995. Now we have grams, right? Here we have pounds, pounds, right? Pounds. Now here, this word, it's a little bit difficult, right? This one is easy, it's inches, right? But how do you think it's called this word? When we, we are, uh, have those small things in the, in the rule, in the ruler. Centimeters? Yes, centimeters, okay. Some people say meters or centimeters, centimeters, right? Both are okay, very good. Now, CM, right, it's centimeters. Very good. We're gonna put it here so we don't forget. Then we have IN, it goes for inches, right? And this symbol is inches too. Quantity 200, 150, et cetera. Now, we have some questions here and some features here from the book, right? Look at this, this uh, table, and based on this table, we are going to answer these three questions. Emerson, can you read question number one? Uh, question number two, Paula Dalberto, and question number three, please, Carla Eugenia. Okay, miss. Can one person store all the televisions oneself? Question number two, please. Please read question number two. I can't talk about a question number number dos. No. Pablo, are you there? Está por ahí, Pablo. No. Eugenia, can you read question number two? Eugenia, can you read question number two? Where can you store 50 refrigerator? Okay, very good. And question number three, please. Tatiana, can you read question number three? Can you sort the towel, the tablet on service? Okay, very good. Thank you so much. So what do you think the answers to this will be? Can one person store all te the televisions oneself? Imagine 200 televisions, right? So let's answer those questions right now based on the table, based on this chart that we have here, we're going to answer these this three questions. So let's start, let's do that individually. We're gonna have three minutes to answer. Let's do that, please. Mm -hmm. You finish? I oh, don't know. Just one minute.
You finish. Do you have your answers, people? Alexander, Emerson, Johnny, do you have your answers? Not yet? Yes, miss. Yes, okay. Yes, teacher. Excellent. Well, finished. Finish. Finish me. Okay. Perfect, 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 perfect. Now, we are going to share some answers here. Now, number one is uh, yes, they can. Okay, yes, they can. One person can store 200 televisions. <gasps> but yes, we can. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much, Emerson. Number two, Yanni, what do you have? Where can you store 50 refrigerators? In a warehouse. In a warehouse. A uh, nice answer. Alexander, can you store the tablets on shelves? No, I can't because they are fragile products. They are fragile products. Excellent. Imagine you put them on a shelf and it starts an earthquake. My goodness, that's going to be crazy. Okay, very good. So we have this. We have we know that there are some descriptions for products, right? Now, I want you to start describing your own products as well. Right? There are a lot of things that we can show you. Some questions that we can use, right? Just give me a moment. I have here a product that I want to show you. But I'm going to share my, my screen, okay? Give me a moment. Da -da -dun -da -dun -dun -dun. Okay, so this is the product that we are going to work with right now. This is my product. And I want you to help me describe it, right? Because that's what we're going to do. And we're going to talk about the features and the functions, the benefits. You remember the benefits? It says here, describing products. And we have a product. What is this pro uh, product? 
what is the name of this product? Print. It's a printer. Yes, Vladimir, it is a printer. The printer prints. Very good. So we're going to make it smaller. Now, with this printer, look at how awesome it is. But it thinks like it's an old printer. With this printer, right, we can use like 10 different questions or 10 different like statements, right, about this product here. We have different, sorry, this is not well. Right. These are like prompts that we can use, right? A prompt, it's pretty much like a way to start your descriptions, right? Look at this, it says here, questions that you can make about a product. Tell me about the printer, for example. Tell me about the printer. What can you tell me about this product? Can you give me some information or details? What is a special or unique? Right? And we have other questions here. Let me tell you about what are the specifications. These here are questions. Right? This other, this is for descriptions, right? right? Look at the descriptions that we can use here. Right, uh, Janira, can you please read these three? And then the next three, Bernardo, let me tell you. Let me tell you, uh, let, uh, pardon. let me tell you about this, uh, these are new, new, new product. Um, this is one of our plays the scene. Okay, very good. Now continue, Bernardo, from here to here. Okay. It is made up. It can be used for, you can use it too. You can use it too. Very good. Uh, let's continue, Javier Castillo. These other three. Is Javier? Sorry, no? repeat, please. Can you please read these three statements? Number three. No, these three. I want. I am selecting this right now. And don't three, two, three, three, four, five. This has contains. This one future. This comes with. Okay. Thank you. And Joanna, read the last four. Uh, this is equipped with um, this particle, particular model. This is priced at this cost. Okay, very good. Right? Now, what we're going to do right now is that we are going to use, let me put this bullets. I'm going to use bullets instead. I'm gonna use bullets here, and we're gonna use here. These are kind. These are kind of questions that we can make, right? So here, right? We know what are the specifications of the printer, blah blah. blah. These are questions, right? But this is what they will help us to talk about the printer. Let me tell you about the printer, right? What is the printer made of? It is made of what? What are the characteristics? In, in, in Chinese. Okay, it is made in China, okay. But when we say it's China. made of, it is made of plastic, is it made of iron? Is it made of paper, wood? What materials. is it made of? Yeah, in materials, yeah. For example, my cell phone, it is made of plastic, right? Plastic and, uh, how do you call? Glass. This is glass and this is plastic, right? So the printer is made of what? Um, 
plastic. Plastic, yeah, it is made of plastic, right? It can be used for what? What is a printer used for? Uh, for work. For work, okay. For um, work, where? What do we do at work? Um, business work. Uh, mm -hmm. For teacher. Mm -hmm. For teachers. Okay, very good. Now, when we say it can be used for, we need to say an activity. For example, the cell phone. The cell phone is used for calling for sending messages. The cell phone is used for taking pictures, for accessing social media. Oof, a lot of things, right? So what is the printer used for? For print and scan. For print, for printing and scanning, very good. Sometimes okay. for making photocopies too, right? <laughs> we make photocopies with the printer. Very good, thank you so much. Now, then we're going to talk about these things. Is this possible? Because there are some of them that can be repeated. For example, when you say uh, this comes with and this is equipped with, it's kind of the same, right? Kind of the same. Now, it can be used for, or you can use it to, it kind of the same, right? You can't or this has contains and this one features, it's almost the same, right? But remember, in English, it's not like in Spanish. In English, we have different ways of saying the things, right? Now, I'm going to share this with you. What we're going to do in groups is the following, okay? I'm sure this is an example only, okay? This is an example. We're gonna share right now this with you. Everyone, will have access to this document right now, but you, you, you can just see it, right? Just give me one second. Why is it so difficult today with my computer? My computer is stuck, just give me a moment. One moment. So start thinking about a product. It can be a, something that you use at work, right? What are, what are your tools to work? For example, my tools to work are my laptop, my headsets, my mouse, right? My notebook, my book. Those are my tools. What are your tools? Right. Think about your the things that you use at work, so you, it's better for you to describe them, right? If you want to use also things that you use uh, in your house, right, that's okay, right? That would be okay, you can do that as well. Now, I'm going to share it with you in WhatsApp, right, the information for this document, and tell me if you can access it. Please, go to WhatsApp. Okay, did you access? Okay, yeah, I see some of you right here in the document. Very good, very good. Now, what are you going to, why are you going to use this document? You're going to use it as your example, right? You're going to take the examples for them so you can complete the ideas, right? For example, let's say if I have, Miss Miss okay. So we're going to have here, right? Let's say we're going to have my product is going to be um, my remote control, right? I have my remote control. 
This is for the for the for the fan, right? So using the prompts there, right? What can you tell me about this product, this remote control? What can you tell me about this? This is a product, right? So what can you tell me about it? It's made of plastic. It is made of plastic. Yes, that's right. It is made of plastic. What else? What? It is small. It is a small. Okay. Very good. What are the specifications for this? Because you said it's small. When we say specifications, sometimes it has like the the dimensions of it, the size. But I think it's small and very light, right? This color is is white. It is white. Okay, very good. What do I use it for? Uh huh. You can use it to control a TV or a camera. Yeah, okay. I can use it to control the TV or the camera. Very good. Very good. What else? It has a long range. It has a long range. That is right. Very good. So right now you are describing a product, right? You're describing a product. Now, once you work in group, you're going to describe one product, right? I'm working with Eugenia, with Carol. We are one, two, three. Three products? No, one product. And you're going to use the examples, okay? The examples that I just sent to uh, WhatsApp. So it's actually going to be easier for you to understand the prompts, okay? Remember that we have plenty. So let me just make this printer smaller because I want you to see everything on the same page. Very good. Now, are you ready to work? Yes? Very well yes. then. Yes. Now just, yes. we're gonna make sure here, the, we're gonna have four groups. Now, eh, Elena, ¿está de oyente? No. Ca ok, Carla, ¿está de oyente? No. Luis, ¿está de oyente? Sí, teacher, disculpe. Ay, sí, botón. Vladimir, ¿está de oyente? No, ¿verdad? No. Yanira Gutiérrez? No. Presente. Ok. okay. Eh, vamos a ver, entonces, este grupo está bien. Daisy, ¿ya llegó? I am here, teacher. Ok. Eh, Ten seconds, ten minutos. Ah, pues ahí ya, en diez minutos terminamos please, la actividad. Please. Sí. please. Ok. Vamos acá. Tan, tan, tan. Joana, estamos bien. Pablo Adalberto, está de oyente, ¿verdad? ¿Y Sara Vigail? I'm here, teacher. Ok, perfect. El otro grupo, Emerson, estamos bien. Imelda Xiomara, está de oyente, ¿verdad? José Bernardo, no está de oyente. Y Tatiana, sí está de oyente. Entonces, vamos a ver acá. José, Alexander, Carol, Oscar, Noé. Y Wendy, entonces solo Wendy está de oyente. Ok, vamos bien entonces. Vamos entonces, let's get to work, right? We're going to have 15 minutes, no more than that. Yo solo lo voy a estar escuchando, ok. Vamos a ver cómo trabaja, vamos. Let's go, let's get to work. Let's go, people.
Emerson, Pablo, Xiomara, Wendy, Daisy, and Tatiana. Please click on your groups. Seleccionen sus equipos, por favor, porque no puedo estar yo en los equipos y ustedes por acá. Necesito que se vayan allá, aunque sea de oyentes. Por favor, denle click. Muchas gracias. Denle click, denle click. Vayan a oír a sus compañeritos trabajar. Así vamos practicando listening también. Vamos. Wendy, Imelda, Daisy, Pablo. Vamos, vamos. Let's go. Rapidito, rapidito, una imagen de una casa. Una casa. Describe a house. Ay, qué bonitas están estas. <risa> Comprémosla. Ay. Quiero ver si me pega así solo copiándola. Ahí está. Bye. It's a big house. Pongamos. Ok. Si seguimos las indicaciones que ella nos dio. Primero tendríamos que poner las, posi las posibles preguntas. Uh -huh. No se puede copiar, vea. ¿El qué? ¿Dónde le puso la, la imagen a ella? Espérame. Del printer. Quiero ver. Me lo voy a... Es un... Es que es un... Me lo voy a compartir. Es, es como es, un link. Sí, es un link. Vamos a ver, espérenme. O quiero ver si puedo. Me lo mandé al otro. Vamos a ver. Sí, deja. Ah, mejor. Entonces sería... Va. Aquí está. Ah, completo. Ajá, ok. Sale mejor. Y podemos contestarlas de otro color. Para que se vea. Vaya. ¿Le damos primero con las primeras? Sí, sí, después ahí le, le da el toque al, al artístico. This product Ajá. is made of wood. Tell me about this product. It's a big house. Is a big house. No describe. It is made of. Is a big house. Así vea. Sí. Yes. It is a big house. It is made of. Está hecho de. It is. No deberíamos de poner una coma después de house entonces. Yes, ah. Uh -huh. It is made made of. Tell me about. Así. No, o madre. 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 Verbo hacer o fabricar. Madre. Mm -hmm. Good. Madera. Good. Good. And W. 
Doble E. Así creo que es. Good and and stung and stung. With with more with more efficient, perdón. No sé si es que va más mejor la palabra porque como ahí dice you can y dejan espacio para ver. Ajá. ¿Qué podemos hacer con eso, verdad? You need a verb. Y termina con, ajá, y termina con, con, con this. Entonces podríamos, podríamos hacer, podríamos poner que you can be, no sé, eh, you can, oh, oh, perdón, you can, you can to be here, en todo caso. Uh -huh. You can to be more no necessary. What can you do with the laptop? Is you can do something with the laptop. What can you do? You can uh, watch videos. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. We did more efficiently. No, that's okay. Mm. Is that? Okay. You can watch videos with it more efficiently. Please. Efficiently. L Y at the end. L Y efficiently. Efficiently. Oh, okay. Ah, oh, yeah. There you are. Okay. Um. This. This house. Contain a, a hard disk. Contain a hard disk of 100. Contain a screen. What is the other? Sara? A screen. I, I don't understand. De pantalla. Ah, es que. Eh, memory RAM. No sé si se escribe. Uh -huh. Memory RAM. Memory RAM. Uh -huh. Soft. Soft. Eh, Contain cable. Cable. Um. Are you working in group? Yes, teacher. Okay. The use sería ese que les he compartido en el chat. I can hear music, pretty new talk with my friends and send message, watch videos and so much more with my cell phone. Ahí tendríamos prácticamente que está hecho el teléfono, qué uso le damos. Podríamos hablar del costo también de, del eso. Sí, el costo de what are the specifications tenemos las características specifications uh, price ads this cost this price
¿Qué, qué precio tiene, Carol, aproximadamente? ¿Qué le pongo? Three, three, three hundred, three hundred dollars. Price at three hundred dollars. Has a gigabytes of RAM, 256 gigabytes to store whatever you like. ¿Cómo puedo tener? En, uh... Lightweight. Lightweight, eso va liviano o ligero. Lightly sería. La batería. Lightly, no, liviano, el peso. No es muy pesado. Ay, ay, ay. Sí. Mm -hmm. Very light. Yes. In the life of Barry, it's lonely. Longest. Okay. So let's start right now. Right. And let's see what you got. Who would like to start? Nobody. Let's see. Janita, give me a number from one. Two, 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 two. One to 20. Um, number uh, 10. Number 10. Give me a moment, it's loading. Number 10. 
Jose Alexander Carvajal. <laughs> Your group stars. Right? Okay. Let's listen to him and to his group. Hi, Carol. Tell me about uh, your cell phone. Carol? Okay. Um, the cell phone, the cell phone is color black it is made of plastic and is a screen a screen is glass okay uh, i continue uh, the I don't know. I, I continue. I continue, Carol. Okay. Um, it's main use is for calls, uh, video calls, video calls, sending messenger, 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 use it in social networks among others. I can hear music, read the news talk with my friends and send messages, uh, watch videos and so much more with the cell phone. This specific model is Huawei Mat Leica. Uh, it's the, the price is $300. Okay. Only that? Only that. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Jose, Carol, and I think it was Oscar, right? Oscar. Okay, thank you. Now choose another group, Jose. Um, Emerson. Emerson's group. Okay. We choose the uh, cell phone spe specifications. Okay, cell phone specifications, good. Yeah. What kind of cell phone? Uh, yeah, um, this is a, a Samsung Galaxy. Okay. Each one. The, this is a new model. It is a one of the lesser design. This will make a tempered glass in the back and the front too. The frame is made aluminum and is resistant to dust and the water. You can use it to make calls and GPS or watch all the social networks. Um, the other, the other model model is from whoa. Uh, well, wait, it has a powerful microchip made of Qualcomm. It is perfect if you have, if you love games or if you work on heavy applications. It has eight gigabytes of RAM, 256 gigabytes to store whatever you like. And also it is very light. It has a big battery with five, um, I forgot how to say me. Cinco mil milliamps. Five thousand. Five thousand milliamps. Just that. Only that. Okay. Yes. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Now, who else, Emerson? Who's next? 
Is your next uh, next cell phone is on Xiaomi? Okay. This is a new new model, and they have a uh, eight eight gigabytes of RAM, a uh, two thousand fifty gigabytes to a store where you to the store the many 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 documents and the photos and application too okay just okay very good thank you so much right thank you and let's go ahead and continue now can you mention another person emerson from another group okay miss um Miss Joanna. Who? Okay, teacher. Miss Joanna. Okay. Okay. Uh, voy a compartir. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, uh, Franco. Uh, Sara. Hello. Okay. Okay. Bueno, leeré la primera y continuarán mis compañeros. Is made of plastic and glass. It can be used for make documents and send emails in your work. You can use it to recite the English class. Okay. You can watch videos with if more efficient. This has contained a hard disk, a screen, memory RAM, <clears throat> cable, or operative system. This one future is compact, lacked of uh, 14 pulgadas, no sé cómo se dice. How do you say yes. pulgadas? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, <clears throat> 11, generation, its color is gray, the core is L7 is netbook model. It's gone with changer uh, case included mouse in mouse phone. It is equipped with Windows 11 Office 365. This particular model is high performance for you. Uh, this is priced at 699. Uh, this product is the solution you are looking for to be more efficient in your work or studies. Okay. Thank you. That's it. Okay, perfect. Excellent job. Thank you so much. Right. And I would like to listen to the last, I think we have one more group. Right, this is for respect. Carla, did you participate? Yes, right? Yes, yes, yes. Who has a Carla. Okay, Carla. Oh, it's a house. Nice. Let's talk about this. Yes, it's a big house. It's made for wood and stone and iron. Uh, this house uh, have four rooms, a large living, I have two level, uh, four windows and one fireplace. This is a cost uh, $40,000. 
it is located in an exclusive area. The house has wood in the marble finish with a family pool and a large garden. This is special that it is in the middle of three that help to have a clean air and there is a pace and tranquility. It is a, it is built on flat land with a lot of stone that have to six to fix the construction. It is has an iron frame the help with possible tremors and that are those in crumble. Crumble. Just that. Crumble, okay. So it does not crumble. Very good. Thank you so much to this group. Right. Well, a $40,000 house, definitely not in El Salvador, right? Here in the El Salvador, houses are very expensive. Very, very expensive. Now we have here right now the practice that we're going to do, right? For this, tell me if you have questions. Questions? No? Okay. Now we're gonna start working with another topic. Let me ask you something. Have you ever bought something online with your credit card or with your debit card? Have you ever bought something online? It's so awesome, don't do it. It's dangerous for our pockets, right? No, you have never bought something online? Hello? Uh, me teacher. You, what have you bought? I bought a case for my cell phone. Oh, nice. Very good. From Casify. Very good. What about you guys? Joanna, have you ever bought something online? I don't understand, teacher. For example, last, yesterday I told you that I bought this package. Right, I bought this package from Amazon. So Amazon is not located in El Salvador, right? Amazon is located in the US. So um, I use my computer, right, to buy it online. Also, here in El Salvador, I bought, I, I usually buy books because I do not live in San Salvador, right? I buy books from La Internacional. No propaganda, no me están pagando, right? Online, right? You can buy them online. Now, what about you? Have you ever uh, bought something online? Bernardo says that he has bought cases for, for something. Okay. you, Joanna? I buy uh, online at CPM. I buy... Carteras, um, thank you. Bags. <laughs> okay. Uh huh. A bag, a bag blue, a blue bag. Uh -huh. A blue bag. Okay. Nice. A blue okay. bag. Excellent. What about the others? Um, uh, clothing for my family. Mm -hmm. With my father, uh, shoes. Uh, at Amazon. Uh, uh, at Amazon. Amazon. <laughs> no, I'm <Amazon>. only. Okay. <laughs> okay, perfect, Joanna. Thank you so much. So we're going to talk about that. Okay, we're going to talk about the process of what you do to buy things online, and this is important because imagine that you get another job, right? With someone in the US and you need to help them buy something online. You are maybe their assistant or you are, or you have to buy something for your company in the future, right? Online, the websites are in English, right? So we need to learn 
the terminology, the words that we need to apply. This is here online orders and refunds, right? So we're going to listen, right? To first the pronunciation I will give you, we're gonna practice pronunciation. But once, if, once we finish that with the pronunciation, we're going to put these steps in order. What do we need to do? These are all the steps, right? To complete a purchase online, an online purchase. So I need you to help me right now. Listen, listen to me. And Eduardo is going to help me with one, two, three, four. Jo uh, Joanna is going to help me with five, six, and Carol with seven, eight, okay? So listen, credit cards information, credit cards information, confirm your information and submit. Confirm your information and submit. Select the items to purchase. Select the items to purchase. Go to the online webpage. Go to the online webpage. Write your billing address. Write your billing address. Check the price. Check the price. Confirm the method of payment. Confirm the method of payment. Log in to your account. Log in to your account. Okay, so we have that there, right? I need you to help me with pronunciation. Franco, you go with the four, first four. Okay, credit card information. Confirm your information in Zoom. Sell a DM to purchase. Go to online web page. Thank you. Uh, write your billing address. Check the price. Confirm the method of payment. Log, log in to your account. Okay, very good. Log in to your account. And let's just practice with this. Uh, purchase. 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 Repeat, Eduardo. Purchase. Purchase. Very good. Very good. Now this one. Right. 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 Perfect. Perfect. Now. What are you going to do? What do you think is the first activity? What is the first thing that we need to do, right? To buy online. Log in to your account. Go to online web page. Go to the online website or log into your account. Let's see. I'm gonna do something right now. I'm gonna do something, right? I am here, right? And I'm gonna buy something. I'm gonna go here. No, I think I don't have the access here. Let me see if I have access over here. Okay, I'm gonna do something. Come on. My goodness. This is so slow today. I'm going to go right now and I'm going to buy something. Okay, so look at this. This is pretty nice, actually. I'm not getting paid for this, okay? Now, right now, I just went and opened a website, right? I opened a website right here, right? And it's showing me here the website that they have, 
Now I am going to, what do you think I should do first? Should I look for the products or should I log in? What should I do? I'm going to log in. It's better, right? Let's see, do I have an account? Yes, I do. Right. Okay, so I go here, click, right? right? And then I see the products. Okay, let's see. Let's buy, okay, let's buy drinks, right? I'm going to buy a drink and I'm going to buy my tostado. So I'm gonna click, right? Here it says cargando, right? It says four dollars and eighty cents. I'm not gonna, not gonna buy drinks anymore. I'm gonna buy here exclusive online. I'm looking for products here, so I can buy products, right? It's classic products. Wow. Now there are no exclusive products for me today. Okay. So I'm gonna click here. Let's see. I have many things on my on my cafeteria, right? So I have my products here. Right, I did not choose this. Oh my goodness, we're gonna take them off. This is my total to pay, 8.71, right? I check my two products. I'm going to click on complete payment. No, I, I do not live in La Cascadas. I live in uh, Chalatenango. I don't need each other now, guys. I'm just messing with it. Right? And then I continue. Okay, let's put my, my address. Right? You don't have selectors here today. Okay. Very good. So now I'm going to click on checkout. Right, I have to pay, right? I have to pay my products. Now I'm going to click on payment. Of course, here is going to ask me for my credit card, my debit card, right? Many things more that they will ask me and they are telling me that I need to buy more products, right? Now, what is the process that I follow? Very simple, right? What did I do first? What was the first? Um, go to the, the, go to the online web, 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 web page. To the online web page. Very good. Go to the online web page. Now we say website. So web page, website. Right? Very good. Go to the online website. Perfect. So we got it there. Now, what did I do next? Login. Login to your account. Login to my account. Okay. Number three. So this one is done. Select the item. Select the item. Okay. Select the item. I don't know, you tell me. Yes, I selected the maíz tostado, right? Select the item. Cafe tostado. Okay, select the items to purchase. Okay. Very good. What else? Check the price. Oh, yes, the price, it was $4, right? Check the price, right? So let's see, check the price, dun, dun, dun. Ba, 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 ba. What else? Confirm the met method of the pay payment. Confirm the method of payment. Okay, yes, I need to decide if it's a debit card, credit card, if it's PayPal, right? Confirm the method of payment. Good, excellent. We're doing the yes. What's the Credit card information. 
Credit card information, that's right. Credit card information. I didn't show you that because that's my credit card. Okay, what happens after the credit card? What else should I put? Write your billing address. Write your billing address. They need to send me my information, right? My product, right? Your billing address, right? Colonia, Tutunichapa, no, okay? Now, in the last one, what is? Confirm your information. Confirm your information. your information. And submit, right? You click on submit and you, very good. I'm just going to weigh my cafe tostado to come to my house, right? So you see how easy it is, right? It is easy. Don't you think it's easy? Buying online is perfect. Compra en línea, bien chido, okay? You avoid the colas from super selectors. Now, you have there the process, right? Do you understand the process that you follow? For processes yes, online? Teacher. Yes, teacher. Right, easy. Very good. Now, based on this information, right, I want you to look at exercise number three. Okay, in exercise number three, what we're doing is that we are going to select those or that to complete the statement, right? We have a sentence. So what is it? This one or is it the other, right? That's what we're going to do right now. I need you to look at those sentences and select the best one, right? You have four statements there. Let's do it. Pretty easy, people. Pretty, pretty easy. you finish? Finish means. Excellent, Tatiana. What about the others? Yes, teacher. Yes, okay. Two people only, okay. Okay, so let's check here. Tatiana, what do you have in the first one? What is the answer for number one? It's necessary the following those steps to purge what some someone needs. What someone needs. Very good. Thank you so much. Number two, please tell me Sara Digail. <clears throat> I think that I want to buy and those beat this. I like it. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, Oscar Noe, what do you have in number three? 
you want to buy this refrigerator? It's coming in four different colors. Okay. This or this? This. Okay. This one? Or no, this. this? Okay. The yes. other one. And the last one, please help me out, Elena. I going to buy this two tablet with this credit card. Okay. So Elena, should I select this or this? This. Thank you so much. Now, what are we going to do? I, I need you to please keep an eye on this, okay? We're going to check the answer in a moment. Now, when we are using these words, these are called demonstratives, okay? That's the grammatical name that we're going to give, right? When someone asks you in grammar, those are demonstrative nouns. So we are going to use those demonstrative nouns today to just talk about things right, that we use either in plural or in singular, right? That's, that's all, right? We're not going to do anything else with them, right? We're going to just uh, use them for plurals or for singulars. Now, I want you to look at my computer right now. Okay. One moment. I will show you something right now. One second. It is loading, so give me a moment. Está cargando. I think we're not gonna have it. Oh, yes. Okay, this is what I want to show you. Now, there is one way to understand this as simple, right, as we can do it. And we're going to look at this right now. With this demonstration, right, we're going to see how we use them for plurals or singulars. Do you see the apples on the screen? Yes? Yes, yes. Okay, very well. So when we are working with this, right? Now, first, first, we need to focus on singulars or plurals. That's the first thing that we need to pay attention to, right? When they say, okay, I have singulars or I have plural. Now, when you have these, in that, both of them are singular, okay? Both, this, that, they are singular, okay? But, but they are different because of the word near and far, okay? Now, I'm gonna use this. This notebook, this notebook is mine. This notebook, okay, now. That notebook is mine. That notebook 
over there, over there is mine. This near, that far, okay? Now, when we're working with this, now we have the plural form, right? Pronunciation here and here is the same. This and this, right? Now, we have these apples, it's near. Those apples is far, right? Remember, here we have plural and plural, right? So I can say, for example, these notebooks near, right? These notebooks, those notebooks, those notebooks, this near, plural, those far, right? Those far, it's plural. Do you see the difference there with this, that, this and those? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, okay, very well then. Now we're going to continue working here, right, with our activity. Now, please tell me if now that we have seen this, right, we have one sentence that it's incorrect, right? There is one answer that is incorrect. Which one is it? The number, the, the number two. Number two, okay. So I think that I want to buy those big desks. Okay, very good. The answer will be that big desk. The desk is one, right? Very good, it's singular, very good. Now, are the others correct? Those are steps, plural, plural. This refrigerator, plural, singular, singular. These two tablets, plural, plural, right? Very good, very good. Now, do you have questions about this? No questions. Wow, no questions, that's nice. Teacher, in continuo en la en frase, la siguiente sería this, credit card. For what, sorry? En el uh, four. Number four. Yes. Do you want to buy this refrigerator? No, I'm no. going to buy this, this two, two tablet. tablet with, with, oh yes, with this credit card or this credit card, plural or singular? Singular, singular. credit card. Yes, that's right. Very good, we didn't check that one. <laughs> Excellent, thank you so much. All right, that would be the best option, right? Very good, very, very good. That would be the best option. Now, we're going to work right now with one activity, working with this and this, right? Just give me one moment so I can show it to you. Now, tell me if you have questions right now, please. Questions, before we continue? No questions? Okay, so let me call the attendance, pasamos lista rapidito y continuamos. I send you the picture so you can remember the explanation. Para mientras carga la lista, right? Y seguimos trabajando acá. Vamos. Santo Padre, eso está lento. Okay, Carlos Vladimir Rodríguez Díaz. Present. Daisy Elizabeth Recinos Álvarez. Present teacher. Eduardo Franco Núñez. Present. Elena Guadalupe Andrade Reyes. 
Present. Emerson Ulises Monroy Calix. Present. I pray, yes, it does. Francisco Sánchez López. Francisco. Imelda Xiomara Pineda Castro. Jacqueline Vanessa Parrilla García. Joana Lisbeth Eunice Alfaro de Canales. Present teacher. José Alexander Hernández Carvajal. Present. José, eh, José Bernardo López Montes. Present teacher. Carla Eugenia Hernández Sotelo. Present teacher. Carol Elizabeth Escalante Enríquez. Present miss. Luis Javier Castillo. Present. Manuel Alfredo Hernández Ventura. Manuel. Oscar Noé Magaña Martínez. Present teacher. Sara Vigail López Portillo. Present teacher. Jenny Bon Torres de Beltrán. Wendy Marlene Martínez Sánchez. Yanira del Carlos. Present teacher. Pablo Alberto Abrego Vázquez. Present. Thank you. Thank you. Me escuchó así. ¿Ah? Me escuchó. Sí. Pero a ver, lo puse todo. Sí, creo que sí. Ok. Ahora vamos acá. We're, gonna, we're going to continue right here. Right. With the practice of these, that, these, and those. Right. I'm going to send you right now to your WhatsApp a very easy practice. Okay. This practice is from level one. So. It's going to be so, so easy for you. Right. Let me send it to you. Okay. Now, what you received there on your, on your WhatsApp was this, right? This is the worksheet that you received. Now, in the worksheet, Right, we have some explanation that we already discussed here, right? When we use things that are near us or not near us, that will be far away, right? Near and far, right? So remember those words, singular, plural, near, far, right? Those are things that we need to remember. Now, eh, Tatiana, can you please read the first part? We use this and this to tell about people, things that are near us. I like I like this ice cream. I want these shoes. Very good. Thank you so much, Tatiana. Bernardo, can you continue? We use that and those to talk about people, things that are not near us. Do you like that picture on the wall? Who are those children Children outside? Outside, very good. So we have this, this, that, and those. Very good, very, very good. Now, look at the examples here. And then we have some sentences here about this. These are examples only, right? For you to have them, and for you to practice. Now we're gonna practice pronunciation with these examples. Now we're gonna go one by one. Number one, Carla Eugenia. Read the examples, open your microphone. These shoes are black. These shoes are black. These shoes are black. Thank you, Alexander. Those shoes are great. Eduardo? This pen is small. Okay, Bernardo? That pen is very large. Thank you. Continue, Carol. The two time on that floor is five. It's fine. Okay, continue, Joanna. 
The time of this cloud is 11.50. 11.50, Yanira. The plane is a toy. Vladimir. This plane is not a toy. Okay, isn't. Repeat. Isn't. Thank isn't. You. Daisy. This car. This car is. I eating. 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 This cat is eating. This cat is eating. Thank you, Sara. That cat isn't eating. Isn't eating. Emerson? Those glasses are the reading. Are for reading. Okay. Continue, Oscar Noé. These glasses are sunglasses. These glasses are sunglasses. Very well. So we have those examples, right? Now, do you understand these examples? Is it clear for you? Yes, or do you have questions? Please tell me if you have questions. Please tell me. The different in pronunciation is. It's the same. This. Um, it's the same. It's the same. It's the same pronunciation. It's the same. Usted lo va a pronunciar igual. Y a decir, Silvia, pero ¿cómo voy, a, ¿cómo voy a diferenciarlo? Por el sustantivo. That's what's going to help us to make it different. Right? Okay, now we're going to go right now and I'm going to show you another exercise that we're going to do for this activity, which is pretty easy. Okay? I'm going to send it to you right now to your WhatsApp about these, that, and those. Mi mamá. Está cargando las disculpas del caso que el señor don internet está un poquito lento. Wait. Okay, I think we got it here. Now this is a worksheet with exercises, right? We have exercises, pretty easy by the way, pretty, pretty easy exercises. Está cargando, está cargando, un segundito. Okay, there you are. You have the exercise on your screen, on your WhatsApp. And this exercise, we're going to, you have it today, but we're going to finish it by tomorrow. Okay, what are you going to do? You are going to read the sentences, the questions, whatever. And here, we're going to put in these spaces the word that is missing, right? For example, number one says, look at, birds there in the tree, which is the best option? These birds, these birds, or those birds? Those birds. Those. Those, because they are up there in the tree, right? Up there. So we say those birds. Very good. So you, I want you to read the scenario, read the sentence, right? So you can select which is the best option. Right now, this is for you to work with tomorrow. Right? Do you have questions about that exercise? Questions Not about the teacher? How oh, means? Okay, very well then. Very well. Now I have time right now to check here with English corporativo. Lo voy a decir en español ahorita que estamos la mayoría. Por favor, encendan sus cámaras. 
esto no es para mí. Okay. Esto es para Insafor. Okay. Yo sigo dando mi clase. Usted tenga su cámara apagada, yo voy a dar mi clase. Pero Insafor toma nota de, todo, de toda la información de ustedes cuando están conectados. Una de esas es que no enciende la cámara. ¿Qué pasa cuando no enciende la cámara? Right. Eso es una falta de, de, lo, de un como contrato que les mandan a ustedes de lo de la beca, entonces por favor enciendan su cámara right. no es para mí por mí ustedes pueden estar en pijama, tranquilos en su casa, no hay problema pueden ir en el busito, en el, su carro para, para, para sus casitas, por mí no hay, no hay ningún inconveniente, ahora eh, ayer solo se subieron notas de Carlos Vladimir Elena, Emerson Imelda, Joana José, José López Carla Carol, Luis Javier, Pablo y también de Sara, Tatiana, Wendy y Janina. ¿Okay? Las personas que yo no mencioné ¿right? no han terminado y no se ha mandado ningún reporte a Insafo. Es importante que usted vaya al día con todas sus actividades. Eh, porque yo no puedo mandar un 40 ni un 60. Tengo que mandar la nota mínima. que es? ¿Cuánta es la nota mínima que tengo que mandar? ¿Cuál es su nota mínima? 50. El 80. El 80, exacto. Si usted no tiene 80, entonces de nada sirve que lo mande. Eh, tiene que mandarlo completo semana tras semana. Eso por experiencia les digo. Hay estudiantes que el último día de clase están haciendo todo. No lo terminan y yo a las diez y media mando lo que tengo y al día siguiente mandan el reporte de Insafor con lo que yo ya mandé y se van a quedar sin, sin la nota correcta solo porque se estuvieron mucho. Okay? So please send your activities on time. Muchas gracias a los que ya lo hicieron, muy bien hecho. Los que no mencioné, no es que no hayan hecho nada, pero no han terminado. Ok, no han terminado, entonces no se puede enviar así. Ahora... ¿Hay alguien que tenga alguna pregunta antes de irnos? ¿No hay preguntitas? No, Miss. Ok, then. Si no hay preguntitas, entonces nos vamos a ir despidiendo. Y for tomorrow, for today, ahora es el día número 6, le corresponde a Francisco Sánchez López, quien no está acá. Entonces tengo un espacio libre de 10 a 10 y 10, por si alguien se quiere quedar con esa sesión. Right? Si no, nos vemos mañana. Have a beautiful rest of the night. Please practice with the worksheet. Practiquen con la worksheet de this, this, those, and those. Si ya lo pueden completar y traerlo ya hecho, mucho que mejor. Así aprovechamos el tiempo. ¿Okay? Y vean los links que tiene el libro abajo. ¿Okay? Vean los links. Eso es su... ¿Okay? Thank you guys. Have a beautiful night. Bye bye. Bye bye, teacher. Bye, teacher. Bye bye, bye. bye, bye miss. Bye bye, Have a beautiful night. Un favor, ¿me podría compartir el link de, de un diccionario que usted mencionó en la primera clase? Yo hasta hoy la pude ver en, 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 el, en YouTube, que yo falté en la primera clase. Usted habló de un link de un diccionario y me metí al grupo de WhatsApp ya después. ¿va? ¿Cree que me lo comparte? Sí, permítame. Lo voy a reenviar en WhatsApp. Okay. ¿Usted está en el grupo de WhatsApp? Sí, sí. Sí, bueno. Sí, entonces lo voy a reenviar en estos momentos. Para que usted lo tenga. O sea, déjeme un segundito. Uy, qué feo es este internet. Se ve que... <risa> Permítame. Este es uno de los diccionarios. Mandé cuatro, así que le voy a mandar los cuatro. Ok. Gracias, Teche. Ok, perfecto, Liz. ¿Tiene alguna pregunta para mí acerca de la clase? ¿Algo que no le haya quedado claro? Eh, no, Teche, está, estamos bien ahí, ahí agarrando lo que podemos. <risa> <risa> bueno, cualquier cosa, ya sabe, para ayudarle. Right. Ahí me avisa sí. si tiene alguna pregunta. Ok. Bueno, gracias, Teche. Gracias a usted. Buenas noches. Have a beautiful night. Bye bye.